This is a yard rake I modified to uh, it's a king cutter rake. Uh, fits on about a 20 well, 30 horsepower tractor. I guess it's from uh, 20 to 35 horsepower supposed to fit on. Category 1 hitch. But I modified it so I don't have to get off of it to tilt the blade. Sometimes that's such a pain to do. I had an extra uh, hydraulic piston, which actually didn't cost very much. I think they're like 65 bucks. You can get one in the hoses. Probably have a hundred dollars into it. Uh, the hoses and hydraulic cylinder and the rest of the stuff I had to, just had laying around and made it work. As you can see, I could I uh, still have some welding to do on it. These are the two hoses hooked to the you know, the tap. Uh, 28 horsepower, 30 horsepower, I guess. I don't know. They call it both 28 and 30. But uh, I think it's going to work. It seems like it should. There should be no reason why. had one hole in there before it just wasn't quite in the right spot and I modified that arm and actually cut that spindle there that took the pin the pin I'm going to cut off just so that I don't uh, end up sticking a pin in there and forgetting about it but that uh, part there is the part I modified a couple pieces of U channel I think had to reinforce it on a couple spots it bent, but that part there I had on a blade, not a rake, just a regular blade, which I have another one back there, which I did modify it and it worked on it for the blade. So I figured a rake should be no problem because it's a foot smaller. But I would like to get it to tilt. The angle, um, the angle the opposite way. That I haven't figured out yet. I have some ideas, but man, it seems like a lot of work to make it work. Which I didn't need another hydraulic cylinder to do, which I have, but, and I have the extra outlets uh, on the Taft tractor. I have four outlets on it, so you need I need two for that and two for the other uh, to get it to go um, horizontal. Actually, I guess it would get it to go vertical, move it vertical and horizontal. Maybe someday I might think of it. Or see somebody who has a good idea would be nice if someone could send me a video of what they have done. You know, best way to learn is to learn by somebody else's mistakes. Better theirs than your mistakes. But that's the best way to learn by mistake, even if it is yours.